What's going on everybody? Come back. I got one of the Bespoke Post subscription boxes and let's check out what all came in it. What's going on everybody? How's my outdoor crew doing this afternoon? I hope you're doing great. Hope your new year is starting to roll right along. Um, I'm just picking up where I left off to be honest. So I decided to pull the trigger on Bespoke Post and see what it was about. The one I particularly got was the Point um, box. Now it's basically an EDC box, small EDC, you know, part uh gear um so i'm gonna run through real quick of what all i got the first thing i got was from the ink pen which is everman.co design pen it is machined out of solid brass it is heavy it's a real heavy pen what i like about it is it's a rollerball pen not just a ballpoint it's a rollerball so it writes really good but I mean, it's it's built strong. It's, I mean, it's got nice pocket clip, and you would think it wouldn't be very grippy, but it's pretty grippy. I don't have any problems with um, holding on to it. And I've been using it for well, I got it in the middle of December, uh, and this is January, so I'm just now talking about the box. Um, but I like the pen. Uh, what's cool is eventually it will patina over time because it's not a uh, doesn't have any kind of finish on it. It's just solid brass, so it will patina over time. Uh, the other cool little thing I got was the little pocket samurai. The name of the company that makes this is Stat Gear Tools. Uh, it's a 440C. Um, now let me show you how small this this knife is. There's the ink pen. It'll go on a key ring because it's got a key ring hole. It is a, you know, forgive me if it's a little bit dusty. It is a liner lock. Little sucker's got a liner lock and a pocket clip. Not a deep pocket, but it's got a pocket clip. Um, it is sharp out of the box. I will give it that. It's a sharp little sucker. Then I got a key ring. I got this little twisted key ring. The way it comes apart is you unscrew this in, slide your keys on. I carried it... For a day or so, this one's made by Cargill. That's a little package that came in. I carried it for a day or so, and I like it, but here's the problem I have with it. And I'll show you real quick. If you have this kind of a keychain on your key fob and slide it on there, well, it's just small enough. The key ring is just small enough. It flies, slides right back off of the key ring itself. So if you were to put it on there like that without using the ring, it'd be fine. I carry so much on my key ring, it's not even funny. Uh, so I tried it for a day with just my truck key and my key fob. And that was the problem I was having is my key fob kept sliding past it and falling right off. So that won't work, but I guess I could take the key fob completely off the little key ring and slide it on separately and do it that way. And then it'd be a very minimalistic, wow, I got that out, uh, key ring for you if you wanted to go with that. I like it. I mean, I think it'd be, be neat to, if I didn't have this, um, I think it would be neat, but I always keep my wife's key on my key ring, so... If anything ever happens, I've always got my key with me. Um, the whole thing was like 45 bucks, and that was, I think, plus shipping. I may be wrong. I'll leave a link down below. I'm not getting anything off of it, but I will leave a link if you want to check it out. What I do like about it, you can subscribe to it, and you can skip a month or two before you get your next box. And that's part of what I'm going to do is skip a month. I don't know yet. I hadn't decided um the pen alone to me was worth the money than the little knife um eventually i may use the key ring try the key ring again and narrow down the keys i carry we'll see but i just wanted to give it a shot and see what it was about 
and I done that. Will I get another one? Probably will. Probably get, like I said, give it a month, two, see what comes up new and different. Uh, they have different styles of boxes you can get. This is what it looked like when it first came in. It was in, you know, wrapped in uh, paper and that kind of stuff. So, cool presentation and all that. Um, so, that's it. Um, my impressions, was it worth it? Yeah, it was. I mean, I think this is a cool little knife. It, you know, if you wanted a small knife to carry on you, it's a good little sharp knife. And a little samurai sword at that. I think that's kind of cool. Oh, let's see the blade again. It, it's it's really neat. It's a really neat knife. And the fact that it's got, you know, this small a knife and it's got a liner lock and it's got a clip on it and you can put it on a key ring if you wanted to with that hole right there so anyway i think it's worth it i think it's worth 45 i'll look and see if i go skip january's box and wait and do november or november february's box depends on what to come out with next and we'll go from there all right guys that's it i hope you enjoyed uh the video and didn't make it too too terribly long don't forget as we say on this channel Beep.